the outcome Saturday was, was not what we had uh, hoped for or expected. I said post game, I said today, uh, the, the Big 12 uh, teleconference, and I'll, I'll say it again here, it, 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 although the, the outcome is similar to last year's opener, uh, th this one feels much different. And the reason for it is because you know, the reason we played so poorly, in my opinion, uh, is actually a good reason uh, because of how close this team has become, uh, how badly they wanted to perform uh, for each other, uh, for their coaches, and uh, you know the the first quarter we just you know I, I I told Gary Johnson yesterday we were talking about it and um, he had never read of mice and men. I told him he needs to read of mice and men, and it was kind of Lenny with the rabbit and with George, right? And that Lenny wanted so badly to to touch the rabbit and play with the rabbit and he he squeezed it so hard he killed the rabbit and there's uh, to me I know that seems maybe out there a little bit but uh, I think that's what the, the first quarter was we wanted it so badly that um, we got in our own way quite a bit and uh, that's correctable and that that also means that when you you suffer a setback uh, like the one that we did your your locker room is still very strong and everybody still believes in what uh, we have spent the last year and a half uh, creating and building here. And, you know, in talking to some other guys too, I, I can, you know, just, we all know the what, you know, it's, it's coaches' jobs to figure out the why. Um, you know, the general fan, anybody can, can tell you the what. They can tell you that, um, you know, we looked disjointed on defense in the first quarter that we went, I think four straight possessions of three and out in the first quarter. I mean, the, the what's are easy. We turned the ball over our last three possessions on offense. That, that part's so easy to diagnose. Uh, the why is, um, you know, where, where coaches make a living. And the first thing you do, in my opinion, is, you know, you, you, you treat uh, your players like mature, grown adults, and, um, and you ask them what they were feeling. And a lot of guys say, Coach, we – we had never, we haven't tasted being this close before, and um, you know it was a different feeling. And so we've got to learn how to manage expectations. We've got to learn how to manage self-inflicted pressure. Uh, we've got to learn how to manage a lot of things, and that's our job as coaches to make sure that that we are capable of doing that.